Right, good morning and welcome to this only described as tropical, maybe? Tropical storm, yes, uh, Tuesday. It is horrible out there. It is disgusting, it is windy, it is raining. Perfect excuse because you're inside to do a home workout, you know? Um, so let's, go, let's make ourselves feel a bit better about ourselves today because let's face it, none of us are gonna be going outside. So I've devised a 22, 23 minute workout for you today. Um, again, it's a matrix style or a pyramid style, however you wanna uh, call it. So you start off with one exercise, you'll always start with that exercise and then obviously we'll add an exercise on and then reverse it and then we'll go the other way. Now, three rounds of this four exercises in each round, and then you've got a nice little finisher. So, haven't done this workout. I obviously made this up and devised it over the weekend, so it might be really easy, it might be really hard. Looking on it, looking at it on paper, it looks pretty difficult today, actually, to be fair. Um, so I hope you can all join in. I hope you've all got yourselves a, uh, a yoga mat or an exercise mat, so we can obviously do the core exercises. How it's gonna work, each round, obviously there's four exercises. You start off with a main, then it'll be a core, then it'll be a main. Now when I say main, that means it's more of a, a pulse racer, so your heart rate goes up, then we're into a core, then we're into the pulse racer and a core. So main core, main core. That's how I've devised it, so it gives you a little bit of rest in between obviously doing the, 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 the pulse racer. So when you do the pulse racer, you go absolutely flat out, as hard as you can, flat, flat, flat out. Then when we go into the core, it's more slow, it's more controlled. Okay, I want you to really feel the core muscles, engage them. There's no benefit in going fast in the core exercises. It's slow and controlled movements. Um, again, I'll try to talk to you throughout the whole workout, let you know whether to go fast, whether to go slow, uh, full range of movement. You know, every exercise we do in these workouts, um, if you do them properly um, and you do every exercise the right form, again, you're gonna burn a hell of a lot more calories than just going absolutely flat out and looking a bit silly, really, and not doing it properly. So, with that in mind, we will uh, not go through the exercises just yet. We'll do the warm-up, and then once we've done the warm-up, we'll go through the exercises. Um, if you can practice them to just keep your heart rate up, that'd be great, because there's obviously quite a few to go through, um, and then we'll crack on with it. Okay, so the best thing to do right now is if you've got your Fitbit watches or your iWatch or whatever, Apple Watch, get it on now. Um, the timer, obviously, is gonna be down there. The, the workings are 20 seconds work and 20 seconds rest. So after the first exercise, you've got a 20 second rest. You'll be like, pretty easy, really. Then obviously, you've got the first two exercises with a 20 second rest, then the first three, and then so on. So by the time you get to the fourth exercise, that 20 second rest, you are gonna need it, okay? Because you've got four exercises back to back. But we'll talk about that a little more in a minute. Okay, so let's do this. Wrist rolls first. Let's turn this music back up again. Can't hear it, I've gone in the way. Ah. The wrist rolls. Let's have them arms out in front, chin to chest. Okay, arms behind, squeeze those shoulder blades together, set your chest up. Good, from there, let's do those arm circles. So nice, big, wide arm circles now. We'll loosen up your shoulders. Okay, let's bring it back in the other way. Good, right, from there, let's have your feet shoulder width apart, we'll squat down, head and arms over one shoulder, and we'll rotate up to the ceiling. So these are the wood chops. Do five on one side, deep squat, rotate, and then switch it. So squat and rotate, guys. It's really important that you get the squat in, as well as the rotation. One more. Good, from there, just gonna start squatting. Nice deep squat, that's got too loud now, isn't it? Go down, go down. Right, squat, let's start squatting. All the way down, come on guys, deep squats. Head and chest up. Okay, it's really important now we start to get the blood flow to the legs. So feet shoulder width, keep your heels on the floor. And then we're gonna leave the floor and do some jumping squats. Now if you can't leave the floor, we're going to tiptoes. Are you ready? Three, two, one. So leave the floor if you can. So nice, power up, cushion it on the way down, protect those knees. Okay, your next one is gonna be those lunges. Are you ready? Three, two, one, so into your lunges now. So nice, deep lunges. So that knee as close as you can to the floor. Looking up all the time, head and chest up. Have your hands out in front if you like. Okay, almost touch the floor with your knee if you can. So three more seconds, then we're back into jumping squats. Two, one, so back in jumping squats, 10 seconds, let's go. 
Let's get that heart rate up, come on. Five seconds there, four, three, two, one, and rest, well done. Okay, now we're gonna sit in and pulse for 20. So we know how to do these now. Feet shoulder width, we sit in the squat, and we're gonna pulse it for 20 seconds. Keep your elbows off your knees, head and chest up. Are you ready? Three, two, one, let's go, sit in. Arms out in front, guys. Look at the pulsing I'm doing. Relax into it. Breathe out. Come on. 10 seconds left. Keep those heels on the floor. Head up. Five, four, three, two, one, and up. Oh. Well done, guys. Let's go down that side lunge. All the weight onto one side. Good, let's switch sides. Right, so keeping those legs nice and wide, let's do those toe touches. So rotate through the shoulders, let's go. Come on, we've all got this, we can all do this. Keep this going, five, four, three, two, one, good. Right, let's have your feet together, crouch down into a ball, and then pull back on your shoulder blades. So keep your heels on the floor, Keep your head and keep your chest up. Let's go, keep it moving now. Let's push it out. Good, five seconds left. Four, three, two, one. Right, I want to go sideways on. Show your hamstring stretch, fingers and the toes. You crouch down, then you stand nice and tall. Keep your legs as straight as you can. Woo. Okay, and repeat, so crouch down. Good, then stand tall again, nice and high. Hold this out, guys. Five, four, three, two, one. Stand up, nice and slowly. So from there, into your hip rotation. So knee up, out to the side, good. Up three outwards. Good, then three inwards. One, two, and again, three. Same other side, knee up and out, one. And again, two. And out, three, good, bring it back in. One, two, and three, good. Start walking around on your tiptoes. So forward and back on your tiptoes. Okay, keep it nice and tall, then revert it, reverse it, sorry, to your heels. Yeah, loosen up those calves. Okay, stand in one position now, and we're gonna rock forward and back. So, on your heels, then on your tiptoes. Nice rocking motion. In three, two, one, good, right, your ankle rolls. Same the other side. Fantastic, right, we are all done, we are all ready. So, first exercise is gonna be a two-step dash. So this is gonna get your heart rate up. So a two-step dash is two steps, touch the floor, you bend down, and touch the floor, two steps back, touch the floor, two steps, and obviously you go nice and quick. If you can't go forwards because of space, you can always go side to side and touch the floor that way, okay? So it's up to you, but don't do more than two steps. So don't go all the way down to the back of your room and then touch it and come all the way forward, okay? It's two steps, it's nice and quick. Bend your knees, head and chest up for out. That's your first exercise. Second one is your core exercise. So we do a V-sit freeze onto your mat, okay? This is the point where your legs are straight and you're leaning back, okay, into a V position. So if you notice, my body's around about 45 degrees. If you're a bit further back, it gets harder. If you're sitting up like this, a little bit too easy. So try and lean back a little bit. Legs have got to be straight, okay? Hold that out for 20 seconds. Really get, oh, excuse me, engage that core. Your third exercise, jumping squats. Again, we've done those. Nice and high, nice and low. Then you finish off with the heel touches. Again, exercises we've done before. So you lay down. Whether you want to keep your shoulders and your head on the floor or you look up, I tend to look up so I can see where I'm looking at my heels. Now, don't have your feet too close in doing this. That is pointless, okay? You want to put your feet far out so you've got to reach and almost like not touch your heel, but get as close as you can to it, okay? So your feet placement on the heel touches is really important in that. Then we do those in reverse. And then we're into round two, Cossack jumps. So one, um, hand on one shoulder, one hand on the other. Now the hard version of this is you're into a narrow uh, squat, then you go wide, back in, and you just keep jumping in and out, okay? 
So it's a real powerful exercise, both legs out, bang, in. If you can't do that and you're thinking, what is that is he doing? Then you stand up, you do a wide squat, narrow squat, wide squat, narrow squat. You can even walk it, squat it in, squat it out. So there's many different variations of how to do a Cossack uh, jump. Then you've got your reverse crunches. So again, back on the floor, reverse crunch. Again, with legs out straight at the bottom, but don't let your heels touch the floor. From your reverse crunch, you have a sprint ladder. So your sprint ladder is obviously high and low, but absolutely flat out. And then you finish off with your shoulder taps. So you're in a plank position. Okay, weight forward, tap, tap, tap. That's really important you don't sway too much. You don't want to see any people dropping their hips or moving their hips. You keep in a plank position, and obviously your hand goes to the opposite shoulder. Tap, tap. If you engage that core, keep everything in that core belt nice and tight. Into round three, single leg hops. I like these new ones, because he burn. So, you've got plenty of chance to obviously switch your leg over. So do on your, we, I'll say do the weakest leg first. So on your weakest leg, you do a reverse lunge, you hop it through, reverse lunge. Notice how deep the reverse lunge is. Okay, knees to the floor, you're up, and then back down again. Obviously, every time you do it, switch up your leading leg. Then from there, you've got in and out. Now, I'm gonna use an object for this. What should I use? In fact, I'm gonna use, I'm gonna use my mum's bars. It should demonstrate how I'm gonna do this exercise. Okay, if you haven't got an object, doesn't matter. I've just nicked it off the side of the lounge. Okay, so you're in and out. You have your hands placement down by your side. Okay, you wanna get fairly close to this if you can. So if you've got an object, great, pick it up now. So you go in, out, in and out. So you go round the object. Now, if you haven't got an object, just visualize something there. So if I take this away, okay, you still can visualize you've got something there. So your knees come up right up to your chin and back out side to side, okay? But I'll just use that for visualization. Guest appearance from the bars. Thank you very much. Um, then you've got four press ups into four scissor planks. So the scissor planks first. Scissor planks, we've done these in hit step. So legs out, legs in, but don't want you to go fast. Okay, so it's one, two, three, four, and then four press ups. One, two, three, and four. And you just keep repeating, okay? So it's four press ups into four scissor jumps. You might speed that up because remember, you've only got 20 seconds. So it's a case of how many you can get in in the time, okay? And then you finish off with a V up combo. Now the V up combo is left hand to right foot. Right hand to left foot, and then both. Okay? Dead simple, he says. Right, your finisher is, you've got power squats. So power squats is you touch, feet together, touch the floor, head and chest up. Okay, then you've got 30 seconds of that, five second rest, and then you've got your floor to sky jumps. So your chest on the floor, then you come up, jump to the ceiling. So the last two exercises are really gonna get your um, heart rate up to the maximum, okay? Hopefully that will make sense. Hope we're all good. Right, two step dash first. Matrix style, gonna be a lot of me standing in front of this today, unfortunately. Right, let's crank that up, let's do this. Right, so 20 seconds work, 20 seconds rest, first exercise, dead simple, this one. All right, I need a quick drink and then we'll start. God, I'm hot already. Woo! Right, are you ready guys? Two step dash, so either forward and back, or side to side, make it a dash. Let's get the heart rate up. In three, two, one, let's go. Touch. Excuse me. Hand down. Forward, touch the floor, bend your knees. Two, make it quick. And back. Let's touch the floor. Come on. You've got a 20 second rest after this, so you can really go for it. Come on. Yes. Right. First exercise done, 20 second rest. You start with that one again. So it's a two step dash. Then you're on your mat for a V-sit freeze. 20 seconds. You get five second rest in between each exercise, by the way, to get yourself in position. Right, five seconds rest. Four, three, two, one. So two step dash first, let's go. Come on, make it a dash. Quick. Let's go. Come on. Let's get your heart rate up. Come on, bend your knees. Should be looking forward all times. Head down, sorry, head up. Always looking forward, bend your knees. Okay, keep going. Oh. Right, we've got a five second rest. V-sit freeze on your mat. 
So hold it out. So lean back a little bit, legs out in front. If you find it too tough, put your feet down. Squeeze the core, lean back. Right, 20 seconds rest. Your third exercise is gonna be those jumping squats. So you see how this is gonna go, okay? Oh dear me. 20 seconds don't seem a lot. So you're gonna go straight back in to the uh, two-step dash. In three, two, one, let's go. Two-step dash, let's go. Come on, yes, Alison. Loving your determination this morning, come on. Nice to join you, join us when neat. Keep going, come on. Let's push, girls. Let's go. Keep it as consistent. Do not slow it down. Come on. Right. Then you get onto your mat for your V-sit freeze. Oh. Hold this out. Come on, legs out straight. Lean back. Really lean back on this one. Hold it out. Come on. Squeeze the core. Look at your, look at your belly and squeeze it. Say, oh, I'm going to own this. Come on. Uh. Oh, keep going. Oh, right, a few jumping squats. Big shoulder width. Let's go, squat and jump, squat, jump. If you can't jump, remember, go to tiptoes. We've done this in the warm up. Let's burn it. Nice, powerful, deep squats. Get some height, come on. 20 seconds, let's go. Oh, well done, right. Your final exercise, remember, is those heel touches. So remember, you've got to lean forward and try and touch those heels. 20 seconds now. We've got all four. Woo. Oh dear, time is going down. Look, we've got five seconds there. Four, three, two, one. So two step dash, let's do all four now. Come on. Let's go. Good, come on, push it out now. Let's do this. Good, come on. Forward and back, touch the floor. Add the power of the legs. It's a dash, remember? Ah, right, get on the floor for your V-sit freeze. Come on, hold this out now. Every exercise get a little bit tougher now. Squeeze, lean back. Hold it, come on. Relax into it if you can. Oh, right, you're up for your jumping squats. Get yourself ready, get up quick. Let's go, come on. So we've got a main one, and then we're into a core. That's how this workout's gonna go, okay? So on the main ones, on the pulse racers, go for it. On the, cut, on the core ones, slow it down and relax. Get your breath back on those. But you still gotta work hard in them, come on. Right, heel touches on the floor again. Feet out in front. So to touch your heel, look up, I tend to look up. If it hurts your neck, you can look to the ceiling. Come on, don't touch the heels. Get your feet placement so they're just, you can't touch them, come on. Wow. Right guys, now we start in reverse. So we do all four again, but we start with heel touches, okay? Oh. So we do them again. This time we go backwards now. So heel touches first, then you've got jumping squats, V sit freeze, two step dash, and then we start knocking them off. Are you ready, guys? So get back down on your mat, get yourself ready. We go again. Three, two, one. So heel touches first. We go backwards, remember? So you've got to do this every time now. This is gonna hurt, I reckon. Oh. Come on, guys. Don't touch those heels. Moving forward, side to side, go. Oh, right, up for your jumping squats. Are you ready? Let's go, jumping squats, come on. Let's leave the floor. Let's make this powerful, come on. Let's do this. Oh. Come on, guys. All four exercises again, come on. Keep going. 
Oh, right, on the floor for your V-sit freeze. So sit and freeze. Let's go. Point your toes. Lean back. Oh, deep breaths. Really feel that. Squeeze your core. Get into a position where you can really feel that. If you're too far forward, can't feel it enough. Lean back. Legs are out straight, guys. Straighten those legs. Come on. Right, last one. Two-step dash. Final time of doing these. Let's go. Two steps. Touch the floor. Two steps. Touch. Come on. Last time. We're doing these in this workout today. Come on, make it count now. Let's go. Push it. Forward and back. Touch the floor. Come on. Oh, well done, guys. Right. We've got three left. Oh, 20 seconds. We need it, don't we? Oh, why does it give me 30 seconds? It's double 30 seconds. We've got 10 seconds there. Right. Are you ready? So on the floor. Three, two, one. Heel touches first. Let's go. Straight to your heel touches. Come on. Keep it consistent, guys. Do not slow it down if you need to. Okay, really reach that heel every time. Good, come on. And again. Oh. Right, are you up? Jumping squats. Let's go, come on, squats, jumping squats, let's do this. Remember guys, we're still in round one. Oh yeah, come on. Come on, let's push it now. Keep going, come on. Push it, jump it. Right, V-sit freeze, final time. Let's go. Hold this out, come on guys, relax. Deep breaths. Don't use any of these core as a rest station. Should activate your core muscles. Come on. Let's go. Well done, guys. Right, 20 seconds rest. We got, what have we got next? Heel touches, jumping squats. Woo. Wow, we, right, are we ready? Jeez, Louise. Okay, right, two left. Are you ready? Three, two, one, let's go. Heel touches first. Let's get down, touch those heels. Come on. Let's go. Come on, let's push. Let's go, keep it going, keep it consistent. Right, up for your jumping squats. Woo! Let's go, come on. Let's finish the round off. Last time we're doing these, come on. Let's go. Come on, keep it going. Come on, push, push. Right, we have 20 seconds rest, and then we go into the heel touches. God, this is gonna be a 30 minute workout, this is, I think. 10 minute round, love it. Oh, right, what we got? Eight seconds left. In five, four, three, two, one. Right, last time, heel touches, let's do it. Finish it off. Come on, be consistent. Good quality reps, come on. Side to side. Finish the round off, let's go. Oh, end of round one, guys. Great effort. Right, we have 20 seconds rest and we're gonna go straight into round two, okay? So your Cossack jumps are gonna be first. Hands on opposite elbow. You either jump it or you're doing an out squat. It's up to you. Are you ready? We're going straight in. In three, two, one. Into round two, so Cossack jumps. Feet together, wide, back in narrow, wide. If you can't jump it, you can always tap it out. Tap out. Tap out, so it's easy and hard. You can mix it up if you want. Make sure you land deep in the squat. Head and chest up. Oh, that hurts, man. So you start with that one. The next one is gonna be reverse crunch. Oh, that gets your heart rate up. So Cossack jump first, then we're into reverse crunch. God, right, I'll be ready. Five seconds left. Four, 
three, two, one. We'll repeat it again, let's go. So if you jump it, great. If not, tap out, deep squat, tap out. Oh, mix it up, I wanna jump. And then I'm gonna mix it up. So if you jump it, oh, mix it up. Make sure you land softly, guys. Keep going. Oh, right. Reverse crunch, get ready. Oh, legs above your head. Bring them down. Straighten your legs at the bottom. Slow you down. So head, legs above your head. Slow this one down. Have your hands just beside your bum. Don't let your heels touch the floor. Really feel this in your core. Straighten your legs at the bottom. Oh. Right, 20 seconds rest. Your third exercise is that sprint ladder. So flat out sprint, knees up. Flip it, it's warm in here. Can't open the door, it's raining. Oh, right, five seconds, you ready? Four, three, two, one. Can't remember what we're doing. I mean, a Cossack jump, sorry. Jump it. If you can't jump, remember, tap out. You've got to keep your el elbows up, head up. Come on. I'm going to tap it now because I'm tired. Okay, deep squat. Keep your elbows up, guys. Keep looking at me. Tap it. Deep squat. Tap. Deep squat. Tap. All right. Into those reverse crunches. Oh, here we go. Let's go. Let's get it up. Slow you down. Back up again. Come on. Back up we go. Reach to the sky at the top. So straight your legs out at the top. And then straighten them at the bottom. Straighten at the top. Straight at the bottom. Oh, right, get ready for your sprint ladder. Let's go. Knees up, come on, let's get that heart rate back up, come on. Climb that ladder. I'll show you sideways. Come on, up. We're climbing, we're reaching for the top, come on. Knees up. Come on, push. Oh, wow, right, last one. It's going to be those shoulder taps. So you're in a plank position, tap opposite shoulder. Oh my God. Are you ready? So Cossack jumps are going to be first. Oh, that's my towel as well. Oh, ah, hang on, wrong one. Ah, didn't get that one. Right, Cossack jumps first. Let's go, straight in. All right, elbows high, all four now, come on. Let's do this. Push it through. Oh, it's burning now. Come on, deep squat, guys. Don't sacrifice these. Good quality reps. Right, reverse crunch. Are you ready? Oh, reverse crunch. Let's go. Keep your legs high. Slowly on the way down. Don't let your feet touch the floor. Well, extend your legs at the bottom. Come on. Let's go. Push now. And again. Right, up. Sprint punch. No, sprint ladder. Sorry, ladder sprint, sprint ladder. Well, let's go. Come on. Come on, guys. Keep working. Keep pushing. This is going to be a longer workout today. I still put the effort in. Come on. Come on, let's go. Let's work. Arms up high and low. And your knees. Come on. Oh, right, shoulder taps, get ready. Oh, tap your shoulders. Plank position, tap, tap. I'll face this way, you can see it better. Okay, plank position, tap, tap. Come on, slow and controlled. Keep your hips tight. Don't move anything, stay rigid. Come on. Good, keep going. Awesome stuff. Right, that's all your four exercises. Now we're going reverse. Oh, sweating. So, start off with your shoulder taps every time now. Woo, right, 10 seconds left. Ignore that. Right, are you ready? In five, four, shoulder taps first. Three, two, one. Right, shoulder taps, let's do this. Come on, all four again. Reverse. Come on. Let's go. Slow and control, guys. Want that weight forward. Squeeze the core. Legs wide. Good, right, ready for your sprint ladder. Oh, let's do this. Sprint ladder, go, 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 come on. 
Arms up. Let's have the power. Go, go, go. Come on. Let's work. Knees up. Come on, let's work, let's go. Oh, right, reverse crunch, you ready? Oh, let's do this. So, reverse crunch. Oh, come on. Again, make it like your first rep. Concentrate. Slow it down. Relax. Feel that core tighten on the way down. Squeeze. Come on. Squeeze it, let's go. Good, right, it's that Cossack jumps. Elbows high. Last time you got to do these. In and out, come on. In. Deep squats, come on. In and wide, out, come on. Deep wide. Oh. Actually, we tap it, don't we? Tap, squat, tap, squat. Tap out wide, sorry, not squat wide. Tap out wide, squat. Tap out wide, squat. Tap out wide. Oh, right. That's the last time we're doing them. Thank God. Right, three to go. Woo! Let's have a quick rest. What have we got? 10 seconds. Okay, are you ready? So you start off with mm, shoulder taps. Three, two, one. Shoulder taps, let's do it. Tap, come on. Tap, tap. See, 20 seconds isn't long, is it now? Tap. Tap your shoulder, come on, tap. Slow, guys, slow and controlled. Really feel that in your core. If you can't do a shoulder tap, hold out a plank. Good, right, sprint ladder time. Oh, here we go. Let's go, sprint ladder, go, go, come on. Oh, let's do this. Let's work, come on. Keep going, knees up, come on guys. Oh, reverse crunch, final time. Oh, let's get down. Let's go, come on. Come on, if I'm doing it, you're doing it. Let's go. Relax, slow and controlled. Come on. And again. Let's keep moving. Wow, we right, two the exercise left. Oh. We've got shoulder taps and sprint ladder. Come on, guys. Body at 20 minutes. Oh, yeah. It's going to be a 30 minute workout. Love that. Right, are you ready? Three, two, one. Right, shoulder taps. Let's do it. 30 minutes of hit. Oh, yes. Come on. Let's make the last week a good one. I told you. Keep it going. Come on. Last round's gonna to be tough when we're fatigued. Right, last lot of sprint ladders, you ready? Let's go, sprint ladder, go, 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 here we go. Last time, come on. Push it. Keep going, keep going, last time you gotta do these, come on. Oh, wow, we right. Straight into shoulder taps. Let's not have a 20 second rest, let's go straight into it, come on. Shoulder taps, in three, two, one. Finish the round off, come on, let's go. We don't need 20 seconds rest, come on. Let's finish the round. Let's go. Shoulder taps. Come on, keep it going. Oh, end of round two, guys. Well done. Oh, right. We're on a 20 second rest and we're going straight into round three. Your first exercise is going to be those single leg hops. So remember, reverse lunge, hop. If you can't hop it, just do reverse lunge and just bring your knee up. Oh my God, it started already. Back off. Right, let's do it again. Three, two, one. So, reverse lunge, hop it up. Reverse, hop. So, nice deep reverse lunge. Bring that knee forward. If you can't hop, just bring the knee up. Reverse lunge, hop. Reverse lunge, hop. We've got plenty of chance to do these, guys. Hop. Deep lunge, hop it through. Oh, that hurts. Right, remember to change your leg this time. 
So rinse a single leg hop, then in and out. So remember, in, out, I've got the vase out for that one, remember? Okay, let's do this, let's, let's get quicker now, come on. Three, two, one, so change your leg, remember. Reverse lunge, hop, reverse lunge. Every time you do these, switch your leg up, okay? So do one side for 20, then the other side for 20. You've got plenty of chance to mix it up, come on. Bang, reverse lunge, concentrate. That's one, right, in and out. So lay down. Hands by your side, visualize the bars. So in to your face, out to the side. In, out, in, out. Keep them high, don't bring them down. Into your chest, lean back a little bit. Into your chest, in, out. Visualize something that you gotta go around. Keep them high. In, out, oh man, that hurts. You gotta lean back a little bit on that one. Okay, third exercise is four press-ups into four scissor planks. But we do those hops first. Are you ready? Hold on one. Three, two, one. So single leg hop. Go back to the original leg now. So switch it up again. So deep lunge, hop, deep lunge. Bring that knee forward. Deep lunge. Bring the knee up. Okay, if you can't hop it, just walk it through like that. Don't have to leave the floor. In. And again. Oh. Right, in and out, on the mat, visualise your object, so lean back a little bit, so have your hands behind your back, so you've got to lean back, my hands are literally behind me, feet together, bend your knees, come on, get your knees right into your chest, lean back, oh. right, four press ups, to four scissor planks, press ups first, Let's go, one, two, three, four, into scissor planks, one, two, three, four, back to press-ups, come on. Do it in your own speed, but get them in, and get at least one set in, come on. Uh, if you have to do press-ups on your knees, doesn't matter. Three, four, five, let's go. Uh, oh. Wow, right, last one is gonna be that V-up combo. So left hand to right foot, right hand to left foot, and then both. Man, I'm getting tired now. Right, 10 seconds left, let's go straight in. Come on guys, we can do this. Three, two, one. Right, single leg hops. No rest now, which leg? I can't remember what leg I'm doing. Come on, reverse lunge, hop it. Reverse, hop it. We don't need 20 seconds rest, guys, come on. Let's do all four. Oh, hop, come on, and I'll hop again. Hop, hop, oh. Right, in and out. Oh. Hands behind you, let's go. Lean back. Slow and controlled. Not a race, remember. Good, and again. Knees into your chest, out to one side. Keep them low, but not too low. Oh man, right. Four press ups, four to the planks. Let's go. One, two, three. Oh God, it's getting tough now, all that. Come on, two, three, four. Let's go again, come on. One, two, three, four. Oh, what's that? V up combo, so lay on your mat, guys. Ah, right, so right foot, left foot. No, right hand, left foot. Left hand, right foot. Then both coming through V up. Same again, left to right. Right to left, then both. And again, left, right, and this side, oh, and both, oh. oh man, right, that's all four, and we've got to do them again, this time we go in reverse, oh man, this is never ending it now, this last round is going to be really tough, okay, you ready, five more seconds, oh. four, three, two, once you start on the floor and you be up combo, okay? So left leg to right foot, change sides, both, and again, left and right, and then both. Come on, left, right, both. Right, four press ups into four to the planks. I'll do it this way. Let's go. So four press ups, come on, one, two, three. 
four, to the pipes, two, three, four, let's go again, come on, come on guys, three, four, Oh, right, what's next? In and out, back on the floor. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, this is hurting now. Go inside, come on. Oh, right, we have three exercises left. Oh no we don't, single leg hop, my bad. So single leg hop, finish it off. Come on. God, let's do this. Right, we're not gonna do the finisher because we're gonna be here for 40 minutes, okay? So we're gonna do, finish this round off, and that'll be it. Oh, because we've got another three exercises to do yet, and it's obviously, everybody's getting fatigued, well I am. So we'll do the matrix, and that'll be it. No finisher. Right, 10 seconds to go. Oh, so three exercises to go, and then we're done, because it's already at 27 minutes already. Okay, B up combo, are you ready? In three, two, one. So on the floor again, guys, let's do it. Let's go. V up combo, left to right hand, right to left, then both. Oh, this is a long workout. I'm gonna get fatigued. 27 minutes and we're still going, come on. Let's go, let's push. And again, both. Right, press ups into the flank. Let's do it. Come on, four press ups. Two, three, four. See the jump, see the plank. Two, three, four. And again, come on, four press ups. One, two, quad. Three, four. One, two, three, four. And again, come on, keep going to the last second. Right, in and out, last time. Oh, let's go, in and out, come on. Slow and controlled. Keep your knees in, rotate round, slowly. Lean back, slowly round. Come on, and again. Well done, right. We've got two left, and we're done. Oh, where's my towel when you need it? I'm dripping. So we've got V up combo first, four press ups into four scissor planks. Are you guys ready? Come on, stick with this. Sorry it's been so long. Right, two left, three, two, one, let's go, come on. V ups, get your V ups in, let's go. And both. Bring your shoulder blades off the mat, come on. Keep it going. We're nearly there. Right, four press ups, four scissor planks. I'll do them this way. Let's go. Keep going now, guys. Come on, we're nearly at the finish. One, two, three. Oh, come on. Go on. Right, we're in our final exercise and then we are done, okay? Man, right. V up combo to finish and then we are done. Oh, right. 10 seconds, let's do this. Oh, longest hit I've ever done. Right, V up combo in three, two, one, and we are done. Let's go, come on. Let's finish this off. Let's do this, come on. 20 seconds work and we're done. Both legs. And again, jambo, let's go again, come on, final time, give it going, last one, oh right, we're done, that is it, we are finished, finito, oh, 12 exercises, done, wow, my god, I think I underestimated how hard that would be. Oh God, that was horrific. Oh. oh God. There is no way we could have another finisher. Not a chance. So what was that? 31 minute, 30 minute workout that was. 
Oh my god, it's so tough. That's what we'll be doing, right? I'm so hot, honestly, I'm ridiculously warm. Oh. Right, it's got to be done because I've got a towel. I'm so hot, sorry. Apologies, but I'm dripping and I need a towel. Sorry. Woo! Sweaty B, are we finished? I'm dead, yes, we are finished. And I'm dead as well. Jeez, man, I'm sweating. What you get when you don't bring a towel, you have to use your top. Oh my god. Guys, well done. Thank you, every single one of you today, for doing that workout. That was absolutely incredible. Apologies for me taking my top off, but I was so hot and I haven't got a towel. <sighs> well done, everybody. Absolutely amazing. High fives to every single one of you. Bam, 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 bam. Yeah, we're so glad we didn't do a finisher. High fives, fist pumps. And repeat the other side. Sweaty pat on the back to every single one of you. And also, I take my hat off to everybody doing that one today because that was unbelievably brutal. That was so hard. Honestly, what was that? 30 minutes of doing hit and the t-shirt is disgustingly wet right now. So, well done everybody for doing it. Sorry it took so long. Again, it's the first time I've done that. Um, I thought it was only going to be about 22, 23 minutes, but each round was 10 minutes long and I was like, ah, we ain't got anything left. So, apologies. Right, are you all ready? Let's do this cool down. So, quad stretch first. Uh, so heel up to your bum, put it in nice and tight. Ooh. Good, switch sides. So what? Okay, from there, let's do the calf stretch. So. Let's have your toes on top of the step, heel on the floor, push and lean your body weight forward. Okay, switch sides. Okay, let's go down to that side then. So all your weight onto one side. Okay, let's go down to the floor, point your toes towards the ceiling. Okay, if you can get that stretch, touch your toes, fantastic. Good, let's switch sides. Okay, down to the floor, point your toes towards the ceiling. Good stuff. Right, everybody sit on the floor. Okay, let's bring your feet close together now. Okay, uh, knees out towards the floor, elbows tucked in, so you push your knees down. On the count of three, we're gonna lean forward and exhale. So breathe out. Ready? Three, two, one, breathe out, lean forward, hold that breath. Good. Good stuff. Right, bring your knees together. And let's repeat. So on the count of three, breathe out, lean forward. One, two, three, lean forward, breathe out. Nice deep breaths, come on. In three, two, one, good. Right, when we stand up, guys, come up nice and slowly now. Take your time. Right, we're gonna go into your lunges. So, lunge position, back knee on the floor. And we're gonna rock forward and back for 10. Okay, we're gonna loosen up the hip flexors now. So keep your foot on the floor, back knee on the floor. When we've hit the 10th one, we're gonna stretch forward and touch the floor with our hands. Three, two, one. So stretch as far forward as you can, keep your back knee on the floor, and just stretch. Try and keep your front heel on the floor as well. 
three, two, one. Good, sweet sides. So it's rock, forward and back, let's go. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Lean far forward as you can, touch the floor. Stretch it out. Okay, again, when you come up, guys, come up nice and slowly, take your time. Okay, so don't go dizzy. Right, from there, let's put your hand down the middle of your spine. Push down on top of the elbow. Okay, switch sides. Okay, from there, hands out, locked out above your head. Lean your body weight over to one side. Good, this switch sides. Okay, from there, so have your hands out in front, chin to your chest, lean forward. And repeat, arms behind, squeeze the shoulder blades together, so shoulders back, chest up. Okay, finish off with one final stretch, arm across your chest, put it in nice and tight. Okay, switch sides. Fantastic guys. Guys, you're all done. Excellent work. Thank you so much for joining me today. Apologies that I've not got a top on, but I'm so hot and I've had to use my top as a towel because I don't think I'm gonna appreciate me dripping all over a floor. So, sorry about that. Um, yes, that's today's workout done. Apologies for it being over, what, 30 minutes long. I do apologize on that, but we're all fatigued, we're all tired, but God, was it a good workout. Um, Back on again tomorrow, I'm gonna to give you the brand new hip step workout. It's called Label, and it's 21 minutes long, so it will be shorter than today's workout. Um, have a great day, guys. Um, obviously not outside, because it's still absolutely pouring it down. But enjoy it the best you can. Thank you so much for joining me today, and I will see you all tomorrow. Cheers, guys. Bye.